some quick dinner, kind of relax a little bit before we go out tonight. I figured I'd give you a quick tour. So I've got uh, we got a fire going at the pit out here for some fajitas, and uh, I've got actually some peppers and onions right in that foil right there that we're gonna saute. And so I'm kind of waiting for that fire to die down, and then we'll do uh, we'll throw some fajitas on there and have ourselves a good dinner before we head out and hunt. But I figured I'd kind of show y'all North Camp. So uh, right behind North Camp, we have one of their huge cattle fields. I think that's North and South Field. And then uh, their quail pen over here that they used to use when when they raised the quail when, when the drought was really, really bad. The, uh, uh, we were driving around today and the quail population, the dove population out here is ridiculous. And uh, it's really cool to be able to come out to a place and not have to worry about like living in a tent or a trailer or uh, whatnot. So you got real nice patio. You can sit out here. It was real, real pleasant this morning. So all right, we'll go inside. Nice living area. I got a TV with a dish if you want to do that. Uh, dinner area, we've got some of our stuff set up, my laptop, and then down here is the cellar uh, that they used to keep some uh, some of the colder stuff. Uh, master bedroom's kind of in here. They're doing some work, but uh, got a king bed and got another TV in here, but really, really nice. Couple couches. This is one of my favorite parts of, of North Camp. This thing runs on the propane from outside. Um, this Vulcan stove is ridiculous. You got a double oven, you've got a hot surface, and then you've got six heating elements. Uh, this thing is awesome to cook on. Uh, got a nice island fridge. Um, cabinets, you know, they've got all the seasonings and your foil and utensils and cookware and they got an RO system out here because the water if anybody knows uh, it's jip water out here it's extremely extremely hard so kind of get a good good view of living area really really nice and then back in there there's a laundry room and then another bathroom so let's go ahead and turn some of the lights on if I can remember here we go. We've got a couple bedrooms back here. This is where Ryan was sleeping. So they've got two twins in every room back here. There's another entrance right over here. Then this another another bedroom that they've got. So another nice bedroom. This was actually the bed that I slept when I came out here for the first time. Uh, back in March and hunted and then this is where my where I'm sleeping at night where I slept last night and then we'll sleep again tonight so and then they got another bathroom and shower in here go back another bathroom right here another bedroom in the back with two twins and then the last ones back here this is where one of the guides John Heaton usually sets up uh, with his TV and he's got his PlayStation and, and whatnot so anyway so it looks like they've got what one two three four five that can sleep so 10 11 12 with that bedroom up front so they can easily sleep 12 out here very very comfortably um, anyway so, really, really nice accommodations. Um, really good place to come back and relax after you've been out in the blind or uh, like with, with pig hunting, we've been going out stalking, walking fields. Um, so it's really nice to be able to come back to a place, have somewhere nice to relax. You can cook your meals. Uh, you just kind of hang out and visit with your friends. Uh, we've got the Olympics on right now. We're watching Lithuania play some basketball against Spain. But, Anyway, so about to put the fajitas on shortly. We're going to eat some dinner, kind of relax a little bit more, make sure everything's uh, loaded, guns are loaded, 
and uh, then we'll go out for a couple hours tonight maybe about three four hours hopefully we'll get back in at a somewhat reasonable time because we got to leave in the morning but um, anyway so it's been fun so far did some shooting today um, you know made sure our um, night vision our thermals were uh, were still on still zeroed shot our truck guns uh, kind of played with those a little bit that was fun and just kind of walked around or uh, drove around uh, the entire ranch today or well, not the entire ranch but a good portion of it and uh, just kind of set some corn out looking for different signs of hogs and uh, trying to set up some some good locations to go get them so anyway guys I hope you all enjoyed tour of North Camps really really nice place uh, and they've got some they're gonna have a, a an awesome year this year so uh, alrighty guys thank y'all